Come over, dog. Hey, corn. Hey, what you doing there? We haven't been on call for like half an hour, have we? I have been spamming your DMs. No, sir. <laughs> no, it's, all right. Today, today we're just gonna do tier lists because uh, I haven't been making videos at all, and I just gotta like grind some out. Uh, we're gonna start with the Kong tier list, and. <laughs> Of course, we gotta start with Dixie Kong, bro. We gotta get Dixie Kong to kick some real tail. Yeah, Dixie Kong got Dixie Kong. Dixie Kong kick, kick some tail. Yeah, she got that glide. She got that dash. <laughs> she kind of thick too. She got yeah. She kind of thick too. <laughs> you know, Dixie Kong <laughs> place in my heart. Yeah, yeah, man. Nah, DKC two. She's just nah. She's like the best character, even though she's like not as fun. Yeah. <laughs> alright, all right. with the classic DK, we always gotta put him in this tier, bro. Donkey Kong is fucking smash. He's, yeah. he's funny. He's a funny character. Yeah, he is. Uh, he's not He's not as good as Dixie Kong, though, because she, you know, she she's Dixie Kong. Yeah. Right, yeah. Alright, all right. we, got, we got Candy Kong. Candy Kong, Kong. A... She's pretty cool. She's pretty cool, yeah. She's definitely yeah. not no sound. Cause she's, but she's kind of a bitch in the TV show. <laughs> yeah, she well, she has style, but like she has no grace. She, so she's pretty yeah. cool. Yeah, I guess she she does have some style. She 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 can rock some clothes. Yeah, I don't know what she does. Okay. Yeah, hey. she, she save points in Donkey Kong Country one, I guess. All oh, right, right. Okay. That's pretty good. Right. That's pretty cool. Hey, right, we got Chunky Kong. Chunky Kong. He's big, fast, and he's, he's pretty strong. He's definitely big. I don't know. I don't know about fast. I, I have. Yeah, he's pretty slow. Time. I don't know. I think he's cool though. Yeah, I think he's pretty cool, dude. <laughs> I like his expression. <laughs> his nose, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely big. Time. Right, right. Then we got we got Cranky Kong. Cranky Kong oh, is pretty man. cool. The throwback with him, like holding, like doing, like the Donkey Kong, like on the. Yeah, on the uh, tree. Not on the tree, but like in the on the Donkey Kong, like seven five M stage like uh when in the beginning of Donkey Kong Country one where he's like using like the old yeah like, yeah see it well he like, is the original Donkey Kong he is the original Donkey Kong you know he you just, gotta respect how do you get so thin though like how do you get so thin bro well when you get old you lose mass yeah but like that much mass <laughs> I think he just got a weight complex maybe I don't know yeah something like that bro. uh hey we got Diddy Kong he's pretty fun he's, he's a lot of fun to control Kong's pretty cool. I, I think he's pretty cool. Amazing. I think he's amazing because you know, kick some real tail. That's some strong words. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, 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 uh, but, 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 Funky Kong, dude. Oh, funky, funky Kong, though. Funky, funky Kong, though. Yeah. Easily he's, kick some tail. So cool. He's so cool. He's like he like he's he's got airplanes. He's got boats. He's got it all. He's, he's yeah, cool, man. dude. So, yo, Just kick came real butt. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying, bro. Yeah. I, I, we got, we got Kitty Kong. Kitty Kong sucks. I hate, I hate, yeah, hate Kitty Kong. Yo, I fully agree. Yeah. Same with Linky Kong. I hate him. I, I don't know. I don't know much about Linky Kong. Dude, have you seen what's it called? Like the Brental Floss video? Like the song? Like the DK? No. Like the DK rap twenty years later? No. Ah, uh, bro, you gotta see it. No, you're gonna. You know, your video's gonna take it down. Nah, man, it's fine. It doesn't matter. <laughs> okay. It's just a reaction video, don't worry. Yeah, it's just a reaction. Okay! Alright, let's get, let's get to the... Again! So the final leap back! Finally! It's been a long yeah. time They're bringing you A brand new rhyme You oh my God. them all <laughs> in DK6 foul you know his name, but behind the scenes, he's this not isn't real the DK. same. After DK sixty four, he got into guns, <laughs> hunts endangered species just for fun. But his coconut gun still fires and spurts. Yeah. He shoots ya, yeah. you probably Yo, die. die. He's older, meaner, and wealthier yeah, too. He's the now, first I'm just gonna skip member to the, uh... of the DK. Wait, no, no, we gotta see the, the tiny Kong. Uh, I mean, the tiny Kong. Tiny Kong. Yeah. 
Listen, this part's good. She can shrink inside. Then we're gonna skip to suit pass. Now you may have no, we're actually not gonna skip. The bees mm -hmm. are dying. Well, but no, we can skip Diddy. About tiny is horrifying. She's killing <laughs> all the bees. She's killing <laughs> all the bees. We don't Bro, that's know what we why, do. That's but she's killing all the bees. She can fly through the air. Okay, get the point. Let's not get every day freaking out. I find some fun. Nope. <laughs> That's like gone. <laughs> Swanky Kong, eight amazing bro. Swanky Kong is swanky. He's got swanky in his name. Yeah, he's, he's nice. He's he's about Cranky Kong, but not above Diddy. Definitely not above Diddy. Yeah. All right. He's Swanky little. Kong. Swanky Kong's pretty. Ah, oh, nah. She's big, fast, and strong. Yeah. She's I think like he's above. rip off Dixie. Yeah. Honestly, like when I was little, I just used to confuse them. Yeah. They're pretty much the same. And then we got, we got, we got, whatever, Rankly Kong, she sucks. Yeah, you have to pay to save, come on. <laughs> you have to pay. Alright, alright, that's our tier list. We're gonna, we're gonna save and download. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. gotta save it. The history, this is a factual tier list. Yeah, Th alright, yeah. alright. Tier list two. We, we're gonna do the mainline Mario games. We probably have pretty different opinions. Yes, right, definitely. So, oh. for, so for the bad Mario games, I think we got... Lost Levels and Sunshine. I like Sunshine. You like Sunshine? No, 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 okay. Where do you where do you put it? Where do you put Sunshine? I put it in good, uh, but so we can agree to put it in okay. I think it's okay. Yeah, because I, I think it has some redeeming qualities. Like it feels okay to control sometimes. Okay. And the level Super design is that bad. Super Mario Galaxy Two, baby. Nah, okay. bro. We gotta we gotta get the we gotta get the worst ones. Alright, so okay. where, we, where we put New Super Mario Brothers Wii? Because I personally think it's the worst New Super Mario Brothers game. I think it's- I actually think it's the best one. Really? I think the yeah. levels are like really boring in this one. But I think the, I think the gimmicks, and I think it, it was before the idea got overused. Right, right. So you want to put it in a good Mario game? Because I think it's a good Mario game. I think it's a good Mario game, yeah. yeah. So my personal favorite is New Super Mario Brothers 2, but that's just because I, I, I love the feeling of getting all those coins, man. I don't know, coins and early been the satisfying thing for me. Yeah, where do you put this game? I put it underneath the Super Mario Bros. Wii. Okay, do you put it in okay though, or do you put it in good? I put it in good. Okay. Um, then we got New Super Mario Bros. I think... I think it was original. I, the first, like, 3D, 2D Mario. So I think it, it goes above New Super Mario Bros. Wii, just because it was, like, the original. I feel like it's really overrated though, because I feel like it offers the least other than like the Mario and Luigi game mode. That one, that's well, a lot of fun. The blue shell power up is good though. Like, the it's blue a shell cool power up. And New Super Mario Brothers U is a very, it's very good, but it's, it's like. Over Where's New Super? Wait, we'll, we'll include Luigi for this. Luigi U? Ah, uh, Luigi U is in it. Yeah, we'll, we'll include Luigi for this for New Super Mario Bros. U. Oh yeah, and if we include Luigi, it's the best one. Yeah, but I, I actually we're not including Luigi because it, this is New Super Mario Bros. This is a Mario tier. It's not a Luigi tier. I so does it just get worse? I'm gonna Over say it's time. okay. Okay. I'm gonna say it's okay. Is you gonna say it's okay, dude? I have so yeah. much more fun in this game than these two. Like, this one I have but, some fun in, but those ones are those ones are original. New Super Mario Bros. U is literally so unoriginal. I played the game like 50 over. I played New Super Mario Bros. U a thousand times. I don't know what you have. I I I I, I, under, I understand. I, okay. Super Mario Bros. 2, I think it's I think it's okay. I don't think it's anything special. Yeah, it's Doki Doki Panic, just I think so I think it goes here. Uh, I think it goes here. I mean, no no, it's worse than Sunshine. Yeah, definitely. I think that's that's but, accurate. but it's not a bad game. It's not a bad game. None of these the last levels. Yeah, the last level is bad. Okay, um Super Mario Brothers. I think it goes Dude, here. you gotta think how innovative it is. Think about but, how innovative it is. But see, we're just we're just ranking this based on like how much we like it, right? <laughs> Play that how, game. Because like it's how good they are. Ah, uh, you're right. But see, I love Compared Mario. to all the other Mario like see, I got a lot of original Mario games. Like I got the Game and Watch, I got the one on the NES, I got the I got it a lot, and I played it a lot. I just don't think it holds up compared to like like I'd rather play Sunshine over the original Mario games, but Right, but you also gotta consider animation, so I'll put it in the bottom of good. Yeah. That's Alright, Mario 3. I think Mario, Mario 3, 3 is, is very good. It's very good. It's excellent, if not perfect. Let's put it in excellent for now, because we can debate Mario World or Mario 3. Yeah. Be pretty done. 
Okay, Mario Land. I think Mario Land is bad. I've never played Mario. Isn't it the Game Boy one? It's the first one on the Game Boy. Oh, that one? I like the Bunny Power-Up. I played that one a little bit on Emulator, but I didn't think it was oh, no, no, that no, good. The Bunny Power-Up power was in the second one. The second one's actually really good. Oh. The I first one only has, like, five levels, and it's... It's not, like, the physics feel off, and, like, the turtles explode instead. Hmm. It's weird. It's called Koopa's Turtles. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Fake fan. Fake fan. Fake fan. Alright, um... I think I think it goes either here or here because I don't really enjoy this game at all. Okay, that sounds good. I, I don't think we can put it in the same tier as Mario Sunshine. It's not bad. Yeah, let's just do <laughs> let's do meh and then let's do bad. Oh wait, no, yeah. let's just do negative okay. Okay minus minus one. No, and then we do bad. Okay, yeah. Yeah. No, we just didn't end here just lost levels. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> right. Mario World, I mm, I like Mario, Mario World. World Mario 3. Perfect. Perfect. Easy. Perfect? Okay. I Sweet. love Mario. Mario World is so good. I right. Super Mario Land and the Six Golden Coins is a very good game. Well, it's not very long, but it's a very good game. I think it's very think good it's tier as well. Tier. I think it's a very good tier. Oh, uh, in, in between excellent and good. Like, oh, because this, this, this excellent and good. There's gotta be a little bit. Okay, add a row above. This is Mario games, so you gotta be pretty specific because they're yeah. all good. Except for lost Yeah, except for lost See, I don't. I, I wouldn't put this in a different tier than New Super Mario Brothers because it's just like New Super Mario Brothers has more to offer than Mario Land 2. New Super Mario Bros. Wii, I think, is very good, but... Okay. Alright, we can do that. I don't want to do that. I think this is better than the original Mario Super Mario Yeah. Mario yeah. Bros. 2 it had, was pretty cool. Yeah. I want to play it, though. The DLC for that game is so much fun. That game had DLC? Yeah, it did. Oh, with those little mini things like the Impossible Challenge? Yeah. Oh, I know those, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, um... Mario 64. I think Mario 64 is overrated. I think it's excellent. I don't think it's perfect. I think, think it has a excellent? lot of- excellent? I think it's excellent. You think- oh! Oh, okay, so where I personally put it is at the bottom of good. You put it at the bottom of good? Do you know how good that game- bro? I've played bro. it so many times, dude. I like the game, but I, I, I don't- I, I don't know. It, it doesn't feel the greatest People to control. Are it's not- the levels aren't- that fun like you think of you think of like the good levels but then you forget about the bad levels and there's so many bad levels like rainbow ride and um what's the other and rainbow ride dude that game that, that level is just so in depth for speed running you like rainbow ride but just because of the speed running route like i've tried it and it's really really fun to practice <sighs> all right can we put it here i guess i'll put a top very good just to compromise yeah. but i think go all right um, it was the first like 3D platformer ever. No, it wasn't. It inspired, okay. Bub 3D, it inspired Bubsy 3D. Super Mario 3D Land. <laughs> I think Super Mario 3D Land is at the top of good. I think it's at the bottom of good. Really? Yeah. You think it's worse than Mario Bros? Uh, I think it was too gimmicky for me. Really? Dang, it's fun. I really like it. I think it's above, like, if this is my list, like, just my list, I'd put it above Mario 64. Um, yeah, but that's you've got a hot, yeah, it's a hot take. Yeah. Alright, uh, what's the next one? We got Mario 64 Sunshine, we got Galaxy. Galaxy Gal is excellent. Gal I don't think it's perfect. What's not perfect about it? Name one it's thing. Not, it's Name not, it's not, it doesn't have Yoshi. But, dude, they were kind of both of them are perfect, like, come on. No, lacking no, yet. it's not as good. Mario Galaxy 2, see, Mario Galaxy 2, so I played Mario Galaxy again, and I was very underwhelmed by the game. Like, people give it such high praise, but I, I played it again, and I just was not, like, I was literally playing, that's right, I, I was having a blast. Dude, like, you know the circular planets? You know how, like, if you hold straight, you'll just turn around? I think it's so janky, like, like, it's not, no, it's a very polished game, but, like, 
It just doesn't. Some stuff doesn't feel right about it. Okay, we can agree to put an X on. How about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course it's X. I think it's the top of X. Yeah. And then Mario Galaxy 2, I think it's perfect. Yeah. Because it, 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 it basically gets rid of all the problems from Galaxy 1, but it removes some of the charm of Galaxy 1, like the, like the actual space vibe. Um, like, it has less of that, but I still think it's better. Odyssey? Perfect. Yeah, I think it's the best Mario game. Uh... I don't know. Mario World is like... I, I have That game is so good. It is? I mean, I think it's good. But I wouldn't, like... I Personally, I wouldn't put any, uh, any 2D Mario game in perfect. All like the extra levels, have you done everything? No, I haven't done everything. It's it's got it's the, the most gradual difficulty curve. I mean, actually, it's not the the best just because of the ghost, the boo world. I forgot what it's called. But you have you have to get secret levels, and I think to a casual player, like someone in the original, who was originally playing it, would not actually know like where it was. So, right. okay. unfortunately, I think second best actually. Okay. And then 3D World, if this was my list, I'd put it in perfect. But I know it's not perfect. I think they, they definitely fixed it with the Switch. I didn't like 3D World. You don't like it? I put it on the Wii. I, put it on, I haven't played it on the Switch, but I re recently replayed it. Uh, I just I just didn't like it that much. I thought it was very underwhelming. I thought it was just good. Just good? It was good. Can we put it at the top of very good? I mean, can we put it... Since since I'd put it in like the top of excellent, and you put it in like just the middle, of, would you put it below Super Mario Bros. Two? I'll put it below 3D Land. Put it. You you think it's worse than 3D Land? Yeah. Dang, bro. Can we can we put it here then to even it out? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, we already did this. And one. second. Yeah. Is there anything we gotta change? Like this order? <laughs> I think. I think. This I think. Works. Sunshine's better than you. No. Yeah. No. Also, I just realized this makes an F. Can we get an F in the chat? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bro, I don't see how you think 3D World's bad. Like, like I guess you kind of, like the Wii U version doesn't feel great because because you're kind of slow in that game. Um, I've played the game just I've just played the game so much. I might I just might have like a like an attachment to it or something. Okay, fine. I guess I'll keep the order. Yeah. Okay, next year, let's go. Final. Uh, do we have time? Yeah, I think we got time. I got plenty of time. No, I know, but like, are we, we running out of time on the screen record? On the screen record? Let's, let's just check. No, eighth year. Got it. Hold on, hold on. We gotta do this now. Because uh, I'm gonna edit this part out. <laughs> okay. Alright. So now we're gonna do an indie game tier list. Uh. We're not going to do all of these, because we haven't played all of them, but we're going to do a good bit. Okay, let's start with the big ones. Cuphead, S tier. Cuphead, S tier? Dude, you Wait. have no idea. <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're right. It's a good game, it's just not for me. Like, like I'm not I'm not good at hard games. <laughs> I'm not good at games. track on the Cuphead in my life. Soundtrack, best soundtrack I've ever listened to. No, sir, no, bro. We gotta, we gotta talk about this. We gotta talk about soundtracks. Dude, I love jazz. I love. I love jazz game. too, but I I, I can't I call it the best soundtrack. Over a decade, I played jazz piano for like literally more years than I haven't. Nice. So I I have so much appreciation for like the process of making the music. It's like all real. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah. Don't don't starve. Have you played that? No, but I've heard good things about it. We'll okay. just put it in like. Have we'll you played? Put, I feel like I haven't played any big one here. Yeah, Limbo. Limbo. How would you have not played? Haven't, haven't, haven't heard or um, heard it's good. How would you have not played and heard it's good? Uh, we can just do haven't played. Well, because because it's it, it just says it's the best, best in indie games ever tier list. Okay, yeah. So it's important. I've not. Okay, Limbo. I Limbo is a very good game. I've not played it. I'm gonna put it in A tier if that's okay. Maybe B tier. Okay. It's like it's not anything. It's not like super impressive. Okay. Have you played the Stanley, uh, whatever this is? Terrible. Yes. Is uh, it I good? think it's 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 a game with a lot of branching paths. What kind of and game is it? It's really 
a story only game. You just yeah. basically move around and ignore what the narrator's telling you to do. <laughs> and the thousand secrets in the game, like it's ridiculous. Sweet. Okay, so Spelunky. I think Spelunky's like mega overrated. I've never played Spelunky. I think uh, it's easier. Though... Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna disagree because I haven't played it. Okay, but so... I, I and I thought it was a massive like uh fuck the player kind of game. <laughs> yeah. Have you played Edith Finch? There's something of Edith Finch. I've heard good things about it. Uh, okay. I just have haven't played it. What about this thing, Owl City? I can't read it. It's like Owl something. Have you played any Owl? Oh, I'm... Owl Boy. Yeah. I've heard of the Owl Boy. Actually. Yeah, me too. Uh, I heard it's a good good game. Yeah, it doesn't look very innovative. However, it's just looking all pop on. Hey, Hall and I. Hall and I. Yeah, I haven't played it, but I've heard it's a really good game. Probably A tier. Cave Story? B tier. Yeah, it's it's very innovative. Like, it's very... Cool. It's a cool game. Yeah. Shovel Knight? That's a good game. S tier. S tier. Okay, okay. We can put Shovel Knight in S tier for right now, but I, I don't think it'll stay. You haven't played Shovel Knight. I know, but like... <laughs> it seems pretty average, I'm gonna lie. Uh, Dude, have you played the... Dude, it's so good. Okay. Like Ukulele, D tier. D tier, okay. Oh, what is this one? I Bastion. You played that? I, I can't read them on mobile. <laughs> yeah, it's called Bastion. Uh, Bastion. Yeah. Oh, that, that's like a steampunk game. I've heard. I, I've heard of it. I haven't seen anything on it though. Okay. So, have you played Bloodstain? Yes, I think it's, it's B tier. Okay. Blood Stain it's uh -huh. Ritual of the Night. Is this yeah. a really good metric? Okay. What about Braid? Have you played Braid? No. Never heard of it either. Okay. Shantae Half Genie Hero is such a good game. It's not it's not S tier or anything. It's just a very good Shantae game. Yeah. Yeah. Celeste? I think Celeste is mad overrated. You do? Yeah. Have you done the B sides? Have you have you gotten no, all the No, I've just I just beat the game out of it. Oh well, the game's got a lot more depth than that. If you just beat the game, then it's not that good. No, I know the story. In the Agree to put it over A tier and put it in A tier. Okay. Uh, over Shantae, but not above Hall Knight. Okay. Have you played Fez? I have not played Fez, nor have I heard of it. It looks like Any? a mobile game. What about Same Gone crazy. Home? Have you played Gone Home? I, I've seen it. Uh, it's like a puzzle game. Uh, I don't know why it's in the greatest indie games of all time tier list. <laughs> yeah. Shantae Half Genie Hero is Shantae. I mean, no, Shantae Pirate Curse is Shantae Half Genie Hero, but better. I mean, it's up to you. I'm not the Shantae expert here. Shantae Half Genie Hero is like the best Shantae. Okay. I agree. Okay. Ca have you played Castle of Heart? No, but it looks like a Dark Souls ripoff, so I'm gonna put it in Dark Souls ripoff tier. <laughs> <laughs> Super McCoy. Oh, that's A tier, above Hollow Knight. Above I love Hollow Knight. How come? Yes. What's your reasoning? It's I love Thomas Nell's platforming. I love the music. I, I love how it, the levels are designed. It just it just sometimes it gets a little bit repetitive, which is why I only think keeping it from S tier. And some it's not for some people because it's just too difficult for some people. So yeah. I, I don't like masterpiece because not everyone can pick it up. Yeah. Okay. Papers, please. Have you played that? Yes. Is I it think good? it's. It, I played a little bit, and from what, what I've seen of it, I love it. Uh, but I haven't played enough of it. What kind of game is it? You're doing paperwork, and you're deciding if you think it's immigration. It's been a while since I played it, but I yeah. think you're like, from what I remember, I think you're like immigration, mm -hmm. and you're deciding what people go into the country or not, and your decisions affect the story. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. I should just yeah. listen to that. I think that it's top of B tier. Yeah, definitely. Cool. I don't know what this is. I can't read it. I think yeah, it's Castlevania. No. <laughs> Listen, Cast Castlevania is not. Okay, so Shantae it? Risky Revenge is the worst Shantae game. Other than the one on the DSi. I, is unless the one, the one on the DSi is. Isn't the one you can play? <laughs> oh, it is the DSi one. Yeah, the DSi one's the worst. 10 out of 10 from Nintendo Life, though. <laughs> nah, it's not a 10 out of 10 game. It's a C tier game. It's like, 
it's it's okay, but it's not it's not it's not like it's just run of the mill platform. Binding Isaac After Earth Plus, my favorite game of all time. Okay, we can put it in the top of us too. My my favorite game of all time. Period. Okay. Sweet. Have you played Journey? No. Have you, okay. Uh, Night in the Woods. Uh, heard a lot of good things about it. It was came out with with the Switch, uh, but never played it. Stardew Valley. That's a good game. Hap haven't played enough of it. Uh, I kind of, I dropped it really fast. I hear a lot Actually. of good things about it. Like I play, I don't really play it, but it seems like yeah, the kind of game I'd get into. But I, I just haven't played it. It just seems like better Animal Crossing. Yeah. Like, or like older kids Animal Crossing, like teenager Animal Crossing. Yeah. Terraria. Oh, S tier. Bottom of S tier. Okay. I love Terraria. We can put it above Shantae. Yeah. Undertale, S tier. I've not played Undertale. Especially Undertale enough. is like one of my favorite games. I love the soundtrack, but I the Binding of Isaac is just too good for me to let it not be a top. Yeah. Okay. Um, we gotta move. We gotta move some of them on because D tier is kind of empty. I think yeah. we can put this game in D tier. Okay. I think we can put no Limbo is not a C tier game. Limbo is a good game. Cave Story. Yeah, I think this is pretty accurate. Yeah. Okay. Well. That's our video, and probably nobody's gonna watch it since it's gonna be long. They're probably gonna watch it for two minutes. And if you got to the end of the video, you're you're actually really cool. And um, that yeah. like button.